Hi, I'm Gina, the plant-based mom, and it's that time again, another way in. Hi, yes, I'm Gina, and welcome back to my channel. Um, let's see, it's been two weeks since I've done a way in and the reason for that is because last week was Thanksgiving and it got so hectic I did not have time to um, film at all and I didn't weigh in. I think part of me was afraid of what the scale was going to say because I didn't cheat per se last week during Thanksgiving but I did eat a little bit more rich meals that contained uh, cashew in it. Like, um, Oh, I just can't think of off the top of my head right now. Um, I, I did film a lot of what I made, but some of the stuff didn't turn out right, and I just don't know if I'm going to share that footage. I'm just going to have to go through it pretty soon and see, because a lot of that, a lot of what we ate last week for Thanksgiving can also be eaten at Christmas time too. So um, I'll have to look through it and see how it turned out. Um, why don't we just jump right into the weigh-in because. Uh, today's video is going to be short and sweet. Okay, so for my last weigh-in, I came in at 229.3, so let's see what the scale had to say the week before Thanksgiving. So the scale says I came in at 226, which means I had a loss of 3.3 pounds. Finally, the scale is budging. That was after complete compliance. I mean, eating pretty much perfectly. I still have, I had yet at that point to, or even now, to <laughs> get back on my walking routine, which is something that has to be done, that has to change. So, but for this point, I was thrilled to see a 3.3 pound loss. Now, I'm a little bit scared about how Thanksgiving went, and then my son's birthday was also here, and we just ate a lot of rich foods, and I tried to eat very little of them, but I, I can tell you that I feel the difference. After I ate, I felt more full than normal on all of these meals. So I just have no idea what the scale is going to say next time I step on it. So um, as for non-scale victories, oh, I forgot to write them down and put them on my little goal board. Um, but this is how my goal board looked. I did okay this week, sort of. Like, from here up, I did good messed up here and then I did pretty good here I missed one day right there of meds and I never got in to do my tanning this week so but other than that look I've been having my daily quiet time and prayer time I've been having oh my water's not the greatest see I did five here whoops can you see see I did five here four here but then I picked it up a lot so much better so I hit my mark four days out of seven and then sleep I've been really struggling with I just I don't know I'm just waking up I'm just waking up and look at this three hours right here mm. so I'd say I probably got to see this week on my goals and we'll work harder next week and I forgot to post my non-scale victories, but I did have a couple, which I'll share with you in just a minute. A couple of my non-scale victories that I can remember um, have to do with eating out. That's one of my big goals right now is to not eat out anymore. Um, I'm telling you, food at home is so much better. Eating out is merely convenience. Uh, we had a few nights that, um, let me think. We had a few nights where it would have just been so much easier on us to just grab a bite somewhere, but we stuck it out and we went the extra mile and made food at home, so uh, we've been doing really well. I think we have eaten one time we ate out, and that was just the other day, so uh, in about five weeks we ate out one time. No, we ate out twice. We ate out for my son's birthday as well, so one's for convenience and one for my son's birthday and I make good choices. So that's, those are good non-scale victories. <laughs> I'd like to see something more like my pants are fitting loose or something like that, but I can't report that just as yet. 
I have no goal board for the for Thanksgiving week. I was not home most of the week. Every day I went to my mom and dad's house and that goal board was just not, it was the furthest thing from my mind. So I have restarted that goal board this week and we'll see how things go for next week because I was not very happy with my progress on the goal board um, from two weeks ago. So I'd like to know how you did over the holidays. Did you stick to plan? Did you cheat? Did you do a plan cheat? I mean, how did you work out everything? Be sure and let me know down below in the comments. If you would, give me a thumbs up for that 3.3 pound weight loss. That would be awesome. If you haven't already, please click that subscribe button down below and be sure to ring that little bell so you, you'll be notified every time I upload and you'll be able to follow my weight loss journey. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Peace out.